part is to actually get the file, and that's actually located. You can do file, open, and then you're going to go under members folder, COVID, laser cut Wilsons, and then you're going to look for the file Wilson V5-2, 2x4 bottom. And the file that you're going to use for the top portion is this one here, the top. But since we're starting out, you start off at the bottom. And then you open the file. And just as traditionally, you download, delete all, download current, and let, let that set up. Make sure it actually goes through this. Uh, download process. So after you put the sheet in, you need to make sure that it's lined up Set the laser right on the edge and adjust it side by side until it exactly lines up as you go up and down here. And you want to make sure that you put the sheet very close to the front of the laser bit here. Then when you have it lined up, you set the laser right to the bottom right hand corner. And then you can run test and see where the laser and it all fits in. And just close the cover and hit start. run for about 13 and a half minutes on the bottom and just over 12 minutes on the top so you should be able to get a whole sheet in about a half an hour so what we recommend is that you actually do calculate how many sheets you're going to be able to do in the, your allotted time let's say you're going to do it for two hours that would be four sheets so you do we would suggest you do four bottoms in a row and then you do four tops. And we'll show you how to do the tops in a moment. Taking it out. I'm just gonna bring it over here to the table. This would be the case where you were doing multiple bottoms at the same time. And then what you need to do is pop out all of the top risers. And this will give you a cut down. Okay. And then what you, what's the critical part here is you want to make sure you save this portion. So you want to cut down here here and then all the way across. So this is what your top piece should look like. And then you take the top piece alignment where you're going to just set the LED 
on the edge, and then you're going to move it down, and then adjust it to make it straight. There you go. 